5 Reasons Not to Go to Law School as a Working Student In this video, I'll share with you 5 Disadvantages of Going to Law School as a Working Student Coming right up Hi, my name is Lex and welcome to Lex in Motion In this channel, I'll be helping you Build your competence, confidence, and capability in law school. If you're new to this channel, please consider subscribing. This video is part 4 of 4 of going to law school as a full-time versus as a working student. On to our cons. Reason number 1. Working students suffer from sleep deprivation. Sleep is the single greatest contributor of success in law school. It's very easy to perform as working students if we're bright, fresh, and early. Full-time students have it easy. We have to live on four, maybe six hours of sleep each day. Yang six hours na yan ay galante na yan. Reason number two, working students suffer from a poor quality of education, especially for executive classes. Executive classes are programs offered for law students to complete law school in about 5 years, having classes only during the weekends. Our professors constantly complain that executive classes suffer from a lot of physical fatigue. They're forced to hold their attention for 6 to 8 hours on Saturdays and Sundays. Swerte na lang kung may naaalala ka pa during and maybe after the classes. Our professors have warned us not to go to executive classes because of the decreased attention span and poorer recall, which they predict could lead to failure in the bar exams. Reason number three, working students suffer twice the commute for work and school. A significant part of our day as working students is spent out on the road. Given the unbearable traffic we suffer to the office in the morning rush and to school during our evening classes, Nakakain na lang ng traffic ang buhay natin. This is one of the reasons why I have started this channel. I want to help you, my fellow working students, with content that we can listen to while we're driving or commuting in the mornings and once again in the afternoons. Reason number four, working students have tough choices when the bar exams come. Some, if not most law schools, have unreasonable schedules for review classes, especially during the fourth year. The review classes are generally offered late in the mornings or early in the afternoons. A professor has mentioned that some law schools do this to weed out those whose focus and attention are still divided during the review. Law schools always want to take care of their bar passing rates. This is why they're almost forcing students to resign or find another solution to balance work and school. Reason number five, working students suffer from increased anxiety and low productivity. Swerte ka if your boss allows you to a certain extent to read during office hours. The typical arrangement is to sleep late, wake up early, konting aral, go to work, and then read through the lunch break. Working students suffer from a lot of anxiety, especially because we come to class somewhat unprepared or realistically not prepared enough. This results in us pushing ourselves even harder or sometimes just being frustrated in general, which leads us to becoming unproductive members of our companies and being average or even below average students. Bukod sa masusing pagpaplano ng vacation leaves for exam week, working students have many other things to worry about. There's laundry, food preparation, grocery, and other errands na hindi na iniisip ng full-time. Being a working law student is not easy, but it is certainly the most fulfilling experience we can have. It is not impossible to finish law school habang may trabaho. Others have done it before us and we can certainly do it too. No matter the pain, the suffering, and anxiety, know that you are not alone. There are others like us who are in a similar situation. Ginusto natin to. 
Thank you so much for watching and I hope I've helped you in one way or another to decide if you want to work or go to law school full time. If you've learned anything from this video, hit the like button below, share and help a friend, and I will see you in our next video.